Right, put this together, engine testing bay. I made the metal stand about two years ago and bolt it in quite easy. I wanted everything in one piece so that you can do everything, build the engine. This section made of metal about 18 months ago. I had it over there on my workbench. But if it's on the bench, I really wanted something like a test station so that I can build the engine, put the heads on, wire it up, do the timing, everything in one particular place. Do what you want with it. Add some wood laying around. This is all wood. 2v1, old kitchen worktop. It's got roller wheels on the bottom. Lock it in place, push the catch it down, you can lock the wheels, the whole thing moves. Very easy to do. Comes off. Comes off. Very inexpensive. Don't particularly need a welder. I'll show you a closer look. See, this is the metal frame that I made about 18 months back, which is great, does the job. Got to put some rubber bushes on here, so when the engine's on it won't vibrate too much. This is just 2 by one all screwed together, very secure. Screwed on there, it's got screws here, screws there, but this piece of wood under here is all bolted down. There's the casters, all kitchen worked up, which is solid. Does the job. You don't have to spend a fortune on doing these things, but the gearbox are going back of here. I've got to put a, a stand here with a pipe going up for the fuel. You can just sit on your chair at the side and you can work on this. You're not limited to where it is on a bench. Just cover it up. Come back out to work. Get in there with this. Just generally moving along. Getting it sorted. But the bench, that's uh, that test station, is good. Quite pleased with that. Didn't cost me much. Had it all lying around. Just had to get a few screws. I think the whole thing only cost me that about five pound so make one up the next time you want one it all comes apart so for what it's worth make one don't be spending money if you don't need to